Jane Russell was born on June 21, 1921, in Minnesota. Her father was a United States Army lieutenant, and her mother had been a student of drama and an actress with a traveling troupe. Jane was interested in drama much as her mother had been and participated in high school stage productions. Upon graduation, Jane took a job as a receptionist for a doctor who specialized in foot disorders. Although she had originally planned on being a designer, her father died and she had to go to work to help the family. Jane modeled on the side and was very much sought out after, especially because of her figure. She managed to save enough money to go to drama school with the urging of her mother. She was signed by Howard Hughes for his production of The Outlaw in 1941. That film was to make Jane famous. The film was not a classic by any means, but was geared through its marketing to show off her ample figure rather than her acting abilities. The film was a smash at the box office. Jane did not make another film until 1945 when she played Joan Kenwood in Young Widow. She had signed a seven-year contract with Hughes, and it seemed that the only films he would put her in were those that displayed her flattering figure. These films did nothing to highlight her true acting abilities. The peak of her career was in Gentlemen Prefer Blondes with Marilyn Monroe. The film showed Jane's comedic side very well. Jane did continue to make films throughout the 1950s, but the films were at times not up to par, particularly when Jane's talents being wasted in forgettable movies to show off her sexy side. Films such as Gentlemen Marry Brunettes and The Revolt of Mamie Stover did do Jane's justice and were able to show exactly the fine actress she was. After the fuzzy pink nightgown, Jane took a break from films to begin to dabble a little in TV. Then returning in 1964 to film Fate is the Hunter. Unfortunately, the roles were not there anymore as Jane appeared in only four pictures during the entire decade. Her last film of the decade was The Born Losers. After three more years away from the screen, she returned to make one last film called Darker Than Amber in 1970. Had Jane not wasted her years, she could have been a bigger actress than what she was allowed to show. Jane Russell died at the age of 89 of respiratory failure on February 28, 2011 in Santa Maria, California. Please enjoy the photos and don't forget to subscribe for more beautiful Hollywood videos. Fun Facts Library. See you next time.